Hello again, folks, and welcome back to Let's Play the Incredible Adventures of Van Helsing. I'm your Game Master Darius. Last we left off, we had finally dealt with Harker. Dude was a punk bitch that was hiding behind a large-ass army. But at the same time, we also had to deal with the Dryads and whatnot that were protecting... Uh... Something. I forget it was... Some, some, the, the Deathless? Something like that. It was a big power. And turned out that... Oh! Uh... Number seven was actually evil. Oh no, who saw that coming? So now we go into what would be, I believe, the third game in the franchise. Well, if it wasn't just, you know, one big old final cut thing of a bob. Honestly, I probably should have done the whole series one by one at later dates kind of a thing, because, um,. Oh boy, do I feel a little bit of that game burnout going on. Load! Faster. Yeah, faster. Noom! Things that make me think I really should just load in before I do anything. Anyway, so... Explore the village trapped in the ink. Uh, ooh, since we're newly loaded. I might have something for you. Uh, you don't have anything good for me. Presumably. Do I want to sell this? Bagorvian... Bagorvian Messor. Eh, I don't need it. Alright. Well... Might as well jump on in and see what's up with this village. Haha, I did you win. Did I do him in? Is Harker dead? I've no clue. This place looks like old Borgovia, before the weird science changed everything. So the ink has some corners that time forgot. Great. Well, that's a concerning a lot of people are over there. Strangers, did you come to help us? Well, it depends. We are a bit picky, you know. What is this place? And what happened here? This is Sanctuary. We used to work in the Inkheart Mines until the accident. We sealed the gate that opened to that accursed place, but... Did you just say accident? But a mysterious man in a mask appeared from nowhere, and he opened up the gate to the mines. He left, but the monsters are coming through from beyond. Prisoner 7. I should have known. We must find that gate. Rest assured, we're going to clear your village on our way through. I like the sound of that. Hey, kid. Are you a hunter, sir? What gave me away? Oh, great. There's a creature we called up from the inkwell. He's called the Pied Piper, and he's supposed to lure away these monsters with the sound of his flute. Please don't tell me that you fell for this old trick. We did, my lady. We did. And he lured away our children instead of the monsters. He is still here, though, but we can't leave this place. I'll find him. I promise. I'll find him. I promise. Can't help but wonder something like, uh, along lines of, man. Did they, like, do all the recording for this, for these games in one go? Was there multiple production dates? Or am I literally playing one game that was actually chopped up into three games? I don't know. It just doesn't seem like that the, um, VAs ever skipped a beat on their... Whatnot. I don't know how far apart these diff these games were from one another. I can only assume not too too far. Oh, is that bugging? He's a big ogre. He could be a big ogre too. Oi! Ah. Big ogres. That wasn't too much of a chore, thankfully.
Yeah, I think it's still just a little bit daunting to me that this game is... ...basically scales all the enemies to your character. Because otherwise, I feel like I would be absolutely decimating everything as I go through. Ooh, or a Calcum War Axe. No, it is shit. Just gotta keep in mind that while you level, probably don't want to be skimping on the gear. I'm not sure where the hell else I'll go with this story. Indeed. I mean, okay, we got on down seven. That's about all I get right now. We're, hu we're hunting down seven in the east. Again, who knows? Maybe I'll we'll end up having... I don't know. <laughs> More wacky whirlwind adventures within the wilds. Oh my lord. Alright, let's bring them a little bit closer over here. Never mind. I, I can... I guess I can, uh... Nope. Alright. I just wanted to be over here, because, yes. Son of a... That's me dead. That's a great start with these ogres. Fantastic start with these ogres. Now, where's this Pied Piper I've been hearing about? Ladies and gentlemen! Oh god, more ogres. I'm mostly concerned about the ogres because those bastards are... ...able to pull me into fights I don't want to be a part of at the moment. Abus. Doesn't help that they're tanky as bulls. Where? Uh, I see treasure. That should make up for the last death I just had. And that goes around a circle. I just realized that there's a blue dot on my map I could go visit. I should probably do that. Probably end up with another side quest, huh? Guests! Finally! You came to test my specialties, didn't you? I ran out of ingredients, sir. So I can only prepare one meal. But that will change the way you think about food. It sounds slightly unnerving. What's on the menu? Well, you can choose a Damavoy steak, a Vricolac pie, or Varianoi haggis. Uh... Domovoy... All of this sounds pretty not good, but mostly because... I myself don't like the idea of eating what might be an intelligent creature, but... Vricolac pie. That sounds like a delicacy. Yes, please. I, I just got a pie. Eh, some HP. I ain't gonna complain. I probably could have gotten some, uh... Mana instead from the other pies, but eh! Yeah, dual voice steak seems like something that's not really my... Wait, what?
Was that a Titanic reference? I'm pretty sure that was a Titanic reference. I... What is... This dead end? I can't seem to go up that way. Oh. It didn't glow while I initially had it on there, so I wasn't sure. The name, like, Fnatic Ogre, I was expecting... I don't know. What are these things, anyways? I mean, that guy was clearly a dude with a gun, which... kinda hardly feels all mystical, but hey. Maybe it is. A mystical guy with a gun. Woo! Stop stepping back like three feet. Dirks the lot of you. Come on. Heck in hell. I'm not even sure where the hell I'm even trying to go right now because this map does not seem to be providing any information about where I have to go. I suppose it was isn't a bad thing because we are more or less just in a new area. Fancy looking bridge. I might as well take a pop up here. And... I mean, I, I see the other monsters. And yes, I got a level up waiting for me. Now, if you wait like five seconds... I'd be ready for combat, but no, you decide to jump on in. Alright. I guess... Walking and physical attacks. Right, and I got four now, so I can do one of these. In the next level, I can do... Soul Trap, too. Actually, wait. Probably silly of me to try to explore all this place. If only because of how much there might just be weaving this way and that way. I love my face or... Ah, excuse me. Oh, this is just another elevator time? Eh, let's go take the elevator first. Hi there. Got a few champions this day, eh? Damn it. Do 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 Suppose I could try freezing them too. I can Gun Towton Bassets. Ah. 
Why? Why is everyone got to have to gun around? Ugh, excuse me. Okay. Oh, these are rat things. Why are they called rat things? I'm- this is the path along to the Pied Piper in it. I don't remember the tale, uh, verbatim. But in case some of y'all don't know what the tale of the Pied Piper is, people tried to... People in the village had a... slew, a plague of rats going on. And so they decided to hire someone. Oh, that guy. They decided, decided to hire someone to try to get rid of all the rats. And hey, lo and behold, he got rid of all the rats with his uh, Piper abilities, where he just sung a tune. They all followed him. And uh, when he went to go to get payment, they refused. So he was like, fine, I'll take your kids instead. And he played a tune and the kids followed along. Hold it right there, Hunter. Before you do anything impulsive, listen to me. It's all a huge misunderstanding. It doesn't sound too convincing with these four children at your side. No. They asked me to take them away from this forsaken place. Look, if you let us leave, I'll be generous. I can give you the source of my power. Do you want me to believe this nonsense? I'm hurt. Prepare to die. Probably would have been a th good idea to just listen to the kids too, but you know... I'll take the children back home. And tell the parents that they shouldn't summon powerful entities to deal with their problems. Noink. Yay. I solve my problems with violence. Hello. Ah, it's a crying shame that such a cool looking thing is worse than the thing I currently got thing eating on. Ah, that dip to the hit. DPS sucks. It should be fine, I guess. That. Oh, well, all that's over. Yeah, okay, I guess that's all that's over there. I'm. Glad that I apparently just happened to have gone the correct direction, though. Gods know how many times that I will have lost any sort of path on a map. <clears throat> if it seems like I'm feeling burpy, that's because I decided to pound back like half a can of Nas before doing this. I probably should have done so a little bit earlier beforehand. But oh well. Hello, are you all the oxen free? There seems to have been a grand total of two people in this mist area. Ah, go through the ink gate that leads through to the Island of Bones. That sounds like a welcoming place. Just, just the best of sounding places. Ugh. This must be the place where the legendary creatures come to die. Judging by the scenery, I'd say that they were captured first. Uh, Prisoner 7 was here recently. I suspect that must have something to do with a strange anomaly. I'll follow his trail. Oh boy. These guys are apparently, uh, a little bit tanky. Chunky grab crablings. These stick lizards, on the other hand. Oh. 
Oh, grub streaks. Yeah, destroy that, please. The less things trying to actively kill me, the better. He says, realizing that he has surrounded by crablings again. God, that feels like so many numbers pop up on screen. I blame the fact that there's hordes of enemies. Ah, scratch my nose. Not that I felt in particular loads of danger. Attack the hive, thank you. God damn, there's a lot of these hives here. I'm so glad that there are so many of these hives here. What are you doing? Look at this skeleton. So there used to be dragons in Borgovia. Fascinating. I'll take a fang as a souvenir. A souvenir, of course. Oh, you nasty boy. I bet you can hardly wait to grind it into fine powder. What? Why would I do that? Don't worry, Van Helsing. Your secret is safe with me. Let's go. I'm rather confused. I mean, I get it, but also what? Eh, Dragon Tooth has a quest item, okay. I'd say that's cool, and it is neat. I'm just kind of confused as to what the hell sort of a quest I need to do with a... Uh, because it's seen as, you know, as far as I know anyways, uh... The quest item. I was just saying I have no clue what the hell to do with it. I barely knew what the hell to do with that ring. Now the game's like, aha! You have a dragon bone. Y yes. I also have a shoe. Does that help at all? Am I gonna do anything with the shoe? Hey, Amen. Okay. Where or how do I get over there? Is it possible that there was a bridge over here? No. I guess maybe I just use the teleporter that's over here. The ink gate. Oh. That did the trick. Good lord, those guys are hardy. Have I been slowed down today? Those dudes have an attack where they just slow me down some. I felt like I was moving slower. I've expected this to somehow be a reference. See a tiny person sitting there in there, probably by the name of Willow. Oh no. It'd be a soldier by the name of Mad Mardigan. 
And you have the option to free him. So he can save the baby! I'm mixing up all sorts of... I was referencing Willow. I need to watch Willow again. Such a good movie. Stick Lizard Frost Talon. Oh, you're a big mean looking guy over there. Ah, minus 54 DPS though. Hmm. You know what? Go ahead, so, go, go ahead, call an episode here first. When we return, I guess we're going to find out what the hell this collector dude wants. Or we're going to kill him. I'm not sure. I say it is the collector. Oh, God. I say it is collector because, I mean, I think it's right there on the quest log. Thank you, everyone, so very much for watching. I hope you're all enjoying the series as much as I'm enjoying playing it. As always, I hope to see you all in the next video. I gotta wake up. Take care. Cheers.